Bringing new meaning to the term farm to table, this sunflower field offers more to the community than a pretty view. Inside each of these seeds is a key household ingredient that many families and restaurants can't live without. Cooking oil. We are an oil seed processing company. Uh, we started this company in 2006. We started to uh, experiment and figure out how to refine oils. And we currently uh, process about 2,000 acres of Pennsylvania crops into edible cooking oils uh, right here in our plant. After months of sitting and baking in the sun, the petals have fallen off the flowers and the stalks and heads are dry. Now it's time for harvesting. During the harvest, the seeds are separated from the sunflowers. The rest of the plant material is chopped up and spread across the field to recycle the nutrients back into the ground. A cover crop will later be put on top of the field to help keep the soil healthy. The harvested seeds are placed into a drying tank where they are conditioned to be able to withstand long-term storage. From here, the seeds come to the mill, but with them also comes weeds and bits of stock and dirt collected in the field. A specific cleaning process is used to remove the excess material. This shaking rotary cleaner sifts the seeds through four screens, pulling out the larger excess material, while a fan then blows lighter material into a separate bin. The cleaned seeds travel through the auger into large storage towers. From here, they will be cleaned one more time before entering the facility. From the storage tanks, the seeds are carried into the facility and fed into a large hopper where they will be crushed. Traveling through the machine by gravity, the seeds will be pushed out of this expeller head. Inside each expeller head, are sharp edges to cut the seeds open, exposing the cellular walls. Through compression, the oil is then separated and the rest of the seed is pushed out as meal. The dried meal is a high protein oil seed cake, which will be used in animal feed as a protein source. The crude oil travels through an additional filtration process to refine it. Now it's ready to be packaged and distributed to local restaurants, kitchens, and even some area colleges. But it's not done yet. At Susquehanna Mills, every part of the plant is used and some of it is used twice through environmental programs with local colleges. When the industrial kitchens have finished with their oil, the mill will take it back and repurpose it into biodiesel fuel. It's a full circle model, vital to the sustainability of local crops, businesses, and the global environment. I want to encourage you to apply for the Covation Center Engage Main Street Cohort Program. In our program, you leave with three key values. First, you learn about your business and how to grow it. Second, you build a network with business experts focused on helping you grow. And third, other business owners that partake in the program with you become your peers and experts and you share with each other. Please join us.